Welcome back guys. My name is Edogs82 and today we're continuing on with our let's play of The Walking Dead Survival Instincts. So we're really close to the end of this game right now. We've made it to the Palmetto Estates and we're looking for information about the supposed evac that's happening here. Alrighty, let's check our inventory out. Looks like we're packing everything we could possibly need. Um, alrighty. Let's check out our survivors. So, Sheila Shinla, can you do something for us? Probably not. <laughs> um, stay at the car, please. I don't exactly want you to die. But let's enter the location and see what we can do about finding that info. Be around, Hillbilly. Bye, Scout. Thanks for my rag back, but you're gonna die now. I can see your father's effect. Alrighty. <laughs> this thing again. Always bugging out. It's the best way to proceed here. So I don't have an objective compass marker, but that just means that I'm kind of free to roam. Oh, damn, check the range on that shot. Just raining death on these walkers from like 200 meters away with a crossbow. It's an insane range for a crossbow. Looks like there's a barricade here. Someone's holed up for shoresies. Let's hop the barricade. Alrighty, let's check this situation out. Anybody home? Did Aiden? Who's Aiden? What the Aiden? Oh hey. Lady Jane Carroll. My husband, Aiden, still knows how to signal the last evac helicopter out. He was supposed to be back by now. He went to check on the Harrisons in the house across the street. I'll go look there then. That doesn't sound good. Hey, we got some MREs, just perfect. Barricaded drive uh, garage as well. I'm looking for you. That'll help us get to the final location. Anything in the kitchen? Nope. Doors barricaded as well. Jeez, these people were thorough. Good job. Got some bullets. Pistol ammo, huh? Well, let's um, chuck that for a second and then reload the gun. And we should be able to pick it up again. We're in a safe place. Yeah, we got the sledgehammer again. Uh, 
Okay, we're good. It's in the bathroom. Anything? No, we got nothing. Damn. All right, moving on. Let's go across the street and ask the Harrisons about Aiden, her husband. Because he was a doofus and apparently got himself lost or something. Well, he knows the way to go to get the evac running again. And that could be life or death, really. They said that there was someone around here, but I haven't seen a single person. This place seems barricaded, but it's like pretty empty. Driveway, there's a sledgehammer back here. We already have one. Petrol, nice. Shotgun ammo, good. And there's a flare, but I don't exactly want that flare. It's kind of useless. My thoughts are there was someone here. I don't know if they still are. Oh, I hear someone. Sup, walkers. That's right, I'm in here. Anybody in this room? And we'll all be. Oh, are you looking oh. for the evacuation point? Hello. You're going to have to come closer. Lost most of my hearing in the service. Oh, dude, she's totally a walker already, man. You Harrison? I'm trying to find Abe. Lady across the street said he was here. Lady? Oh, Jane. Yes, Aiden was just here, but left for the mechanic shop just down the road. You should be able to catch him. Thank you. Please tell him to begin. It won't be much longer now. Yeah, I can see that. Oh, yes, there's a pharmacy in the shopping center. Can you please bring something to ease my wife's suffering? Dude, she's already dead. That much is oh, painstakingly obvious by the fact that her eyes are like the way they are. Sneak through all the backyards, see what I can find. This place is barricaded up, not getting in there, damn. Oh, hello, friends. <laughs> Eliminating these quietly is the best thing for me because I don't want a whole pack of them coming down on me. So I have to take them out quietly. I can only I don't really have to deal with them one by one, which is good news. Oh, this place is infested. <laughs> Apparently whoever was holding up in here didn't make it. Looks like they put up a good stand though. <laughs> nice try. Nice try baiting me with that petrol and then hiding back there. Oh, you nearly got away, lady. Better luck next apocalypse.
We got some more pistol ammo. Nice. Um, sledgehammer, please. I don't give you this crap. No, 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 no. I want to pick the sledgehammer up. No! Damn it! <sighs> we just lost the sledgehammer. Hey, friend. I'm surprised he hasn't moved. <laughs> so easy. Goodness, that was too easy. All these baits to try and jump skin. This is hilarious. Nice try. Come back next week. Oh. No, I'm leading my shots too much. That'll cost me big time, I reckon. Nice. My crossbow bolts over here somewhere. Nah. Oh well. I'll just grab this one. I just come from not over there, surely not. I would have noticed that walker. Maybe I did and I just didn't register. <laughs> okay. Let's check this place out. Uh, hatchet. No thanks. Where was it? Um, there was a sledgehammer in the Harrison's basement, which I can use to replace my sledgehammer, that I lost. I mean, not their basement, their garage. Thank you. Back to hammer time. Yeah. Let's drink a walker raid. Mm, that's better. And go back to our hammer spree. You know, let's just get rid of this one. Because we can. Oh. Interesting. 
Oh man, I need that. Alrighty. Let's go. So basically cleaned out the immediate cul-de-sac of Palmetto Estates and talk to the people that are around here. <laughs> Be fast with my swings. Not bad. But um, pretty much we've just got this way to go. Let's try and use as many of these crossbow bolts as we can to annihilate as many walkers as we can. So we don't have to take them up close and personal. Damn it. Well, that goes there with that plan. unless we absolutely have to. So we're down to just three crossbow bolts. Things are starting to get hairy because I might have to start going loud. Things are not going so well. This area is just getting more complicated. Man, this place is lousy with walkers. Didn't do 
that. That wasn't me. You can hear anything. Oh, this guy. Gotcha punk. Okay, we're good. Let's line this walker up that's on the bridge and take him out. I can't believe I'm down to just one bolt. One! This is bad. Staying quiet is going to be a difficult task. Hey, I see a guy. That must be the husband that I'm meant to be looking for. Hey, hey you, up here. Yes. I knew it. I freaking knew it. I want to not be using a ranged weapon in here because I feel like, yeah, I'm going to get attacked from all angles, really close range. This one, I can deal with at a range. Because he's dead, apparently. He looked like he was alive. Antibiotics. Okay, that's what we needed for um, Harrison's wife, who's totally already dead. <sighs> I'll be back. Oh no! I'm just swung. <laughs> All this more than one? Goodness. What's back this way? My walker. <coughs> Hold on. Oh, hello. That fence is not going to hold. That's not comforting at all. <laughs> yeah, neither is that fence. <laughs> Semi auto. Oh, wow. And we got more. Ammo. Aiden's bag. What the hell? Okay, because executing wasn't working, we just clobber him with the hammer. Ooh. 
Someone's mad. Look, dude, I'll come back next time after I get those antibiotics. <coughs> Harrison. So let's do this quickly. Run back to Harrison, give him the antibiotics. Come back to Aiden, see what he wants. <coughs> and then be on my way. So I've got three MREs, that's good stuff. And that surprise gang of walkers is not good stuff. This is not Harrison's house, this one over here is. Harrison, I'm back with the antibiotics. Whoa, whoa! Dude! I'm sorry. I thought there would be more time. I love you. Well, I knew she was I already going to be a walker. I promise you that. Oh, the medicine. <clears throat> Thanks anyway. Here. Um, you okay, man? Please be quick. I have to find my girls. Alrighty. Okay, so now we need to go back to the mechanic shop and talk to Aiden. See what we can do about that evac. Uh, that gunshot just brought down a whole mob of walkers. <coughs> Idiots. I don't want anyone following me, jeez. Stay away. <laughs> Alright, let's quickly move up to the mechanic shop and see what we can do. And this place is starting to become populated with walkers again, even after I cleared it out. It's like bull crap. <laughs> Oh, hello. Let's pop an MRE for good measure and climb the ladder. You what? Come here. Look, there's only one evac chopper left and the clock's running out. Aiden. So how do I get out of here? Okay, all right. You need to get a bag I dropped in the mechanic shop and then smoke pots to signal the FEMA choppers. These things? Yeah, okay. You go back. Get my wife and Harrison. Once we light those smokers, we have 90 seconds to pick up. I'll update you on the radio. Let's light them up then. The sooner I'm out of here, the better. 90 seconds. You don't bring them back. You're not getting on. Come on, go. All right. Let's go. Thanks for the ammo, buddy. I'm going to need every shot. Feel it. get away from him, I will. Okay, let's find Harrison and Jay. 
Oh shoot, the chopper's already here. Oh man, there's so many. <coughs> Looks like we're going loud. Come on now, walkers. Who's hungry? You want a piece of me? I'm gonna go save Jane because she's younger and probably got longer to live, to be honest. Totally out of shotgun shells now. Damn, this place is locked too. What the hell? How do I get in? Backyard? Chain. You saved me. You did it. Thank God for you. What happened to Aiden? Chopper came and took him. Wouldn't let him off. They're going to Atlanta, which is where I'm going. You coming with me? It's Atlanta then. All right. Sorry, Harrison. I had to choose. All right, guys. So. Looks like we're heading towards a place called Fire Science Stadium. And, excuse me, um, that's actually the last location on the map, so it's the last mission in the game, and we'll get to that tomorrow. But just as a quick preview, what it says about Fire Science Station is it is a staging site for the largest scale military evacuation operation. Fire Science Stadium is heavily defended thousands of refugees and joint military units so when we come back we'll be making our way to Fireside Stadium and the finish 
to the conclusion of this game. So I hope you guys have all enjoyed this episode of The Walking Dead Survival Instinct. My name has been... Well, my name is <laughs> eDogs82. And I'll see you in the next episode. Alrighty. Bye, guys. Yeah. <laughs>